all. Welcome back to the channel. Um, it's been a great week. Um, I haven't really done a lot of wrenching out here in the shop, but uh, uh, we do have a little bit of stuff going on. Uh, if you can see behind me here, we got uh, Mark's uh, Pro V twin engine in here. Uh, we're going to be working on that. Um, but uh, I was on vacation last week. Um, for some of the new subscribers that you know don't know, I work a 40 plus hour a week job. I do YouTube on the side. Um, try to video as much as I possibly can while I'm out here in the garage, while we're at the tractor pulls, you know, my cooking videos, all that kind of stuff. Um, but uh, yeah, um, this is just a, uh, this is a sideline gig for the YouTube. Uh, I take it serious, but it is a sideline, side job. Uh, but uh, so last week, I uh, set up on vacation and I'm doing a lot of stuff uh, it got hot it got really hot it was in the 90s outside I come in the shop here we were pushing 99 to 100 degrees in the shop with the doors open um, too hot for this old man so um, I know y'all say oh you ain't that old I'm old and fat it you know it's too hot um, humidity was super high so didn't get a lot of stuff done. I did get some stuff done, but it's all stuff you guys seen me do before. You know, I serviced a couple riding mowers, um, changed some blades on those mowers. Um, I worked on a weed eater. Um, it's all stuff you got. I mean, don't. To me, it doesn't make good video, but it is what it is. So, um, so now, yeah, we're uh, we're doing this video. Um, we're gonna go over, like I said, go over what we what we're doing in the shop, what's coming up in the shop. Um, we are gonna get back on monkey business. Um, got plan B going we if you watched a couple videos ago we watched the uh, we did get to a tractor pull did really well the timing advance helped out a lot um, we tweaked the carburetor a little bit uh, we only stayed for one round uh, Bo Mark son uh, he had to work Sunday night so we stayed one round it got got fairly warm his tractor wasn't running worth a crap I didn't want to make them sit around and hang out and, you know, because we run together, you know, going to and from. Um, I didn't want to make them have to hang out before I can make another pass. It's not that big a deal to me. But uh, he uh, he is getting his motor parts in for his motor to get it going. Uh, hopefully all the right parts. Um, when, the, when that engine was put together by someone else and the guy was told what parts to buy, he didn't buy those parts he bought cheaper parts and they're not right um, if you guys watched the, the last video on the final assembly um, they had flat tappet lifters on a roller cam that's a no-no you'll tear that cam up you'll destroy the lifters um, we found out that it doesn't have the the bigger crank in it it's got the stock crank in it um, that won't do uh, for the pistons and stuff that are in it um, in the cam it's all, all that stuff has to work together um, but yeah um, so he's got all that stuff ordered um, he don't know what coils are on it he don't know if they're the new style with the internal rev limiter uh, or the old style the part number that's on it uh, comes back to the old coils but the way it was running it sounded like it had a rev limiter um, it wasn't would not make any go-go so um, yeah uh, uh, so that's about what we got going on I um, uh, guess we'll show show some tools that we picked up over the last few months uh, thanks to you guys all and thanks to all the new subscribers old subscribers especially the guy people that's been been with me from the start or you know for a long long time we hit 4,000 now we're over 4,000 but we hit the 4,000 sub mark that's awesome I never thought this channel would even do a thousand to hit 4,000 um, and we're at uh, 775,000 views I think that's what it said the other day when it popped up when I was going through some stuff um, yeah, I've, I've got one video that's got 
250 or 260 some thousand views. Uh, Nate from Go Karts Are Gone Fishing was telling me, uh, y'all, uh, that blows my mind that, you know, y'all, y'all want to watch this old man. I mean, I think, I think the stuff's interesting. You know, I can't believe that, you know, I'm, I'm appreciative. I mean, I really appreciate y'all watching. I truly do. But, uh, uh, so, yeah, uh, I'm rambling on. So, let's look at some tools and stuff that we got, uh, that we've picked up over the last few months because of y'all. Um, because of the rev, you know, I, the revenue, I, the little bit of revenue I do get from the channel goes right back into the channel, into the tool shop tools and stuff like that to upgrade and, uh, you know, maybe help shoot better videos and stuff like that. Uh, you'll see some stuff coming up, you know, um, that kind of lose to that. So, uh, yeah, um, yeah, that's what I got. So let's let's check out the tools. All right, y'all. Uh, we're gonna start out. Um, I think I've showed this tool on the uh, channel before, but it's the uh, Bauer uh, belt sander. A little, I think it's half inch wide, three quarter inch wide, something like that belt sander uh, this thing uh, I bought it to work on um, monkey business and it has I mean I've almost wore that belt out I've got more to put on it but yeah this thing has been a lifesaver I've used it tons and tons so uh, nice thing is you know you can rotate this around uh, store it you know you just fold it in lock it down you know you're good to go so but yeah, this thing, uh, well worth the money. It, I mean, it is corded, but you know, it it gets the job done. Um, like I said, I think uh, in a couple of the videos we used it uh, on monkey business, but hey, you know, well worth the money what I paid for it. So that's the first thing. Uh, next thing is I picked up a couple of these Bauer or Braun lights. Um, got two of them. Uh, with the members, Inside Track Club members, they were 20 bucks a piece. These things are phenomenal. I mean, three light settings. Uh, that's the low. That's the medium. Oh, I went too slow. There's low. There's medium. And there's high. Um, actually, I'll turn it around for you guys can see it. That's low. Medium and high. 90% uh, of the time, I just have it on the low setting. That throws off plenty of light. So and they are rechargeable. They don't take the little batteries. The magnets on them, you know, that, you know, that's pretty good and strong. Uh, I always used to buy these ones, you know, the stick ones from uh, Braun, but you know, you barely, barely touch that thing. Oh, there, and it just went on the floor, um, you know, and I've broke, I don't know how many of them things in half, it's not even funny, but, you know, and these were only 20 bucks a piece, so, those, great deal, you know, I love it, so, you know, we're actually, I'm going to stick one up here, give you guys some extra light, Do -do -do -do. so, yeah, alright, so, alright, on to the next thing, uh, Next thing we picked up, this is a uh, jump and carry. Uh, jump, it's a jump starter, power pack. This thing, it's nice, it's expensive, but it's nice. Um, I picked it up used off Marketplace, uh, brand new in the box. Um, they only used it once or twice. The person that had it didn't like it, so I picked it up really cheap. These leads are like two feet long, nice big heavy clamps. You know, and it's got uh, uh, well that's your uh, it's 15 volt, yeah, 15 volt, 10 amp out. I don't know what you'd use that for, but uh, it's the uh, got the charger port on that side. Comes with a little charger. Comes in a nice little bag. It's in the house. Two USB ports, and then up on the top is where you plug your your uh, leads into. And it's got an override button, so if you have a completely dead battery. Um, I had a little bit of trouble trying to get the override to work. Um, a little finicky, but uh, I did get it to work. But, 
I've also used it on some batteries that were just partially dead and you know not enough to crank the vehicle over but there was still some juice left in them and the thing works phenomenal so and oh it also has a uh, light on the end of it oops that's just to turn it on and off you know got that got a fast SOS you know slow flash so all right uh, there's all that stuff um, uh, one more thing we bought we bought a 3 8 digital torque wrench we got this off of uh, Vivor I did pay for it uh, you know this is the Vivor welding table we're filming on but um, this thing's really nice um, it does the does inch pounds and foot pounds uh, like I said it's 3 8 drive uh, just it's really nice uh, one of the cool things is it comes with uh, some sockets uh, the smallest one is uh, five or yeah six millimeter and I believe it goes all the way up to 12 uh, yeah 12 so six to 12 millimeter five or six Let's see what the smallest one here is I can yeah six millimeter so yeah six to 12 millimeter sockets you know but uh, I've used it used it a couple times I did check it against my half inch Carlisle and the foot pounds and it's spot on and the nice really nice thing about this thing is it's under 100 bucks um, you can find a coupon or a discount code sometimes and uh, you know it's even cheaper than that so but I've been wanting a, a digital 3 8 drive torque wrench I have the click styles this actually goes a lot higher than the uh, than the uh, click style 3 8 drives um, I got it primarily to do the head bolts and stuff on the Kohler command engines um, the click style doesn't go high enough and it was a big pain in the butt using a half inch style you know the digital one or the click one um, it's just a lot of unnecessary so um, so yeah there's that and oh one thing other thing too is on this case the only thing I don't like about this thing is the sockets have to lay down you can't you know um, I guess I could get a little rail or something to put these things on but yeah it, you can't uh, you can't leave the socket set up or you can't get the, the case click shut so all right there's that and then the last thing um, some of you might know some of you might not I'm on TikTok. you know I, I watch more videos than I play or upload but I do upload a one or two here and there um, the TikTok store got me uh, it sucked me in I've been looking for uh, an inexpensive decent like action camera something like that something other than my good uh, digital video camera uh, which was relatively expensive to buy um, for out here in the shop or you know out and about you know I don't want to destroy that camera but um, I bought this this is a no name little digital video camera it does take stills and it takes video it shoots in true 4k uh, 16 zoom uh, it's nice it's got the I put a little piece of tape on it it's got the flip out screen you know hi you know there's you guys um, it's got the flip out screen on it the only thing is I wish the screen would rotate some uh, but you know it is what it is but uh, I've been trying it out um, you may or may not have seen some uh, video already with shot with this camera um, the only other thing is is I need to get a exterior external mic on it the mic on this I mean it shoots great stills and very clear nice uh, video the audio isn't so much um, it does have a hot shoe mount but it doesn't say in the book or anything if this is actually a real hot shoe if it's a powered or not or if it's just a hot shoe mount it almost looks I mean it has the it has the contact and stuff in there for a hot shoe so um, I don't know um, I'm looking at a um, 
I'm looking at a mic for it, an external mic, because it does have, you know, where you can, on the side here, where you can, uh, HDMI, uh, your USB, and a mic, stereo mic plug-in. Uh, it's really nice. Uh, it actually did come with a USD, or a micro USD card, which is right in there. Um, just got to be careful when you take the, when you take this uh, card out. Make sure you have some your finger or something over it because it will shoot clear across the room. And of course, you know it's got a battery in it. Um, come with one battery, but uh, not a big deal. So um, it's got a lot of nice feature features. Anti shake. Um, the the stability on the video. You have to, I mean, you almost have to use it with a tripod. Um, I've shot some with it, and it, it likes to shake and everything. But, uh, you know, uh, on a tripod, I think it, it would, it's awesome. So, okay, um, that's about all we got on that. That's all the tools we have. <whistles> Goodbye. So, uh, that's all the tools and everything update. Um, and all, the, all this stuff I've bought has been... Because of you guys watching the videos and stuff, uh, the income that I get from YouTube, which isn't a whole lot a month, um, I invest it all right back in the motorcycle. Um, I invest it all right back into the channel. So uh, the the torque wrench, the camera, the jump and carry. No, the jump and carry was kind of half and half. Um, you know the lights. You know all that kind of stuff. Uh, thank you. That's all because of you guys so um that's gonna be it uh for this segment let's uh move on to the next one all right y'all uh last but not least we got uh this uh pro v twin engine uh, if you're familiar with the channel and been around a while you know this is the engine we were putting together for mark from over at twisted v twin garage uh we kind of had a uh issue with getting some of the parts and stuff for it to finish it uh, they weren't available uh, but they are available now so he's going to be ordering them and he's going to be uh, getting them to us and we're going to finish putting this thing together and hopefully getting it run um, uh, so yeah there's the uh, that's the update on that one all right y'all that's going to do it for this video. Uh, if you've stuck around this long, thank you very much. Um, if, you, if, you're, if you're a subscriber, thank you very much. 90% um, of people that watch these videos aren't subscribed. Click the subscribe button. It's free. Ring the bell. It helps the channel out. Um, you know, it, uh, it, it's, it's an algorithm thing. Um, but, uh, yeah, uh, appreciate it. Uh, and... Uh, Again, thank you all for sticking around for these many years. We've been doing this, and thank you for all the subscribers. Uh, you know, we've got it over 4,000. Uh, we're shooting for 5,000 by the end of the year. Um, some of y'all that uh, watch these videos that aren't subscribed would click that little button. Like I said, it's free. We could hit 5,000 by the you know by the end of the year. Um, that would be awesome. Uh, that would that would. Uh, that would make me feel, you know, even better than I feel for 4,000, of course, you know. You know, every, every subscriber, every, every time I see the subscribe button go up, uh, numbers go up, I'm, I'm flabbergasted, I'm, a, I'm taking aback, you know, that, thank y'all, <laughs> that's all I can say. Um, but, yeah, appreciate y'all, and uh, uh, keep watching. Uh, we got some stuff coming up, um, got some work on Plan B. Got some work on uh, monkey business. Um, hopefully we're going to get back on monkey business and get, get some more of that stuff going. But, uh, yeah, so uh, uh, let me know how you like the, uh, the new camera. Uh, it is, uh, we're recording this segment on the new camera. So let me know how you like it. If you think it's good quality, if it looks good, let me know. So, um we're probably going to, you know, if you all like it, and, you know, I like the way it, it uh, I just got dive bombed. Anyways, uh, if I like the way it goes into the editing software and stuff, uh, you know, uh, we're going to keep using it. Uh, so, anyways, appreciate y'all, love y'all, and uh, 
catch you all on the next one.